All right, today we are going to play my first RPG ever. Ape. It's Earthbound. Or Mother 2, whatever you want to call it today. And I do not have any saved files on here because I have already erased them all. Yes, I do own the actual cart for this game. And the big, huge book and the big, huge box and all the stinky, smelly uh, things that came along with it. We are not using any custom names because that is Ness. And that is Paula. And that is Useless. And that is him. And that is Dog. Does Ness like bacon? Pie, pasta, cake, eggs, bread, salmon, steak. I guess he does not, so we'll go along with steak. I have never actually looked through these ones. It's always been PK rockin'. Hammer. Love. Gift. Slime. Gaming. Boxing. Nope. Yes, I'm sure. All right, uh, this game came out uh, sometime in the 90s. I forget what it is for Super Nintendo. Uh, it's very different. It's not like the usual RPGs that you play. It's set in more of a modern area, and it's obviously in its own world also, because there's some weird, crazy things that happen in this game. But Ness... Ness is, I'd probably say, one of the best uh, heroes I've ever seen. Even coming from one of my favorite titles, Final Fantasy VI, Final Fantasy IV, I think Ness is actually above them. He's, of course, one of the silent heroes like Chrono and all that, that, uh, you know, they just don't talk, but somehow they still get their points across. Uh, so let's go ahead and start playing. Uh, this is Ness's room. Doesn't have a TV or anything in here. That's how we lived back in the day. Going into our sister Tracy's room. Get out of my way. I'm stealing a Christmas present. And I'll take your baseball bat. Goodbye. Try to show me any affection. Get away from me. There's mom, there's dog, and the phone. We'll talk about the phone later. And mom's got a palm tree in her house. Uh, is it down the thing? Yeah, down this way. Police officer, cop cars. Apparently Ness lives in the mountains somewhere. More officers. Christmas present. Maybe it was Santa that crashed up here. He's dropping his presents all over the place. Oh. Goodbye. Oh, Pokey. Or Porky. Or whatever you want to call him. You're getting in the way of the cops. Oops, I mean officer's way. I, Pokey, will tell you more about the strange meteorite. I'm fine here, but you're bugging the officers. I used to have a friend like that. Oh, we're going home because we can't get by all the officers, and Piggy over there said he's going to tell us about what's going on. So we're going home. Cause it's late at night, and we gotta go to work tomorrow. Let's equip the baseball bat. Police officers here and here. They're not doing anything, they're just dancing.
Well, you're going the wrong way, and you're not moving too fast. Oh, hi, Mom. Yes, we're going to bed. Later that night. Oh, sounds like some douchebag is banging on the door all late at night. So now I gotta get out of bed again. Shut up, Tracy. You stalking me, Mom? If that's Porky out there, I'm gonna be so upset. Oh, it's him. I took Picky to the place where the meteorite landed. Snicker. <laughs> to deal with the sharks. Uh, yeah, the sharks are like the local gang or whatever, I guess you could say. We're going to meet them a little bit later. And Picky was gone. Because I am the worst big brother in the world. I was off eating some cookies or something while... Yes, I'll help you find Piggy. Not really. Okay. Should take Dog along. And I've already stole her Christmas present. Go for it. I don't wanna. Oh, great. And now here's the nest we know. Sadly, most people introduced to him through, I guess, Smash Brothers being a secret character. Um, he is very, 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 very different from that character in the game. We'll actually see with some of his uh, psychic abilities. He does not get PK Star Storm or PK Fire. He does get PK Flash, though, but it is not a damaging spell. If I'm remembering right, it actually uh, gave status effects, random status effects to the enemies. So, eh, useful, not useful sort of thing. I never use it. Ah, oh, somebody's calling us in the middle of the night. What? Oh, it's Dad. Where are you, Dad? You better give me that child support money and put it right into my bank account. Thirty dollars! Yes, I've got my ATM card. Good luck, my boy. Beep. All right, let's go. We've got to find Picky. Oh, here's a dog. Runaway dog. Let's see. So these are the different options you get. Obviously, bash is attack, goods, whatever is you've got in your inventory. Uh, defend, defend. PSI is basically your magic, which Nest does not have right now. Uh, run away, obviously tries to run away. Auto fight just lets the computer do whatever it wants to do with your mana. <laughs> so we're going to start by bashing the runaway dog. And the dog missed. King attacks for three damage. Pokey complained. And Ness got a critical attack, 19 damage. And the runaway dog became tame. Ness levels up. Maximum. Life up A, that's his first spell. Yeah, it's a heal. It's a butterfly up there. Oh, it's a crow. These things tend to steal your items. Ah, oh, let's see if I can get another critical. Pokey smile. Uh, nope, 11 damage. Yep, he stole my bread. 
Didn't I just steal that myself from somebody's Christmas present? Pokey acted all instant in again. Oh, dodge. Big grin on his face. That's a, one of the better things about some of these earlier enemies. You can just level up on them because a lot of the times they just don't do anything. Uh, he left a present. It's going to be a cookie, isn't it? Cookie. But he stole my bread roll. Ugh. I think the cookie gives back about 6 HP and the bread roll gives back about 12. Oh, uh, we got another dog. Just missed. King does 7 damage. Pokey complains again. Ow. 7 damage. Yay, we win. Four experience. Oh, look, it's another crow. Ow. Pokey used Ness as a shield. Pecked at my eyes. Two HP. Oh, Ness, you're gonna die. Let's eat that cookie. Six HP. Ah. Oh. Pokey thought to himself, what is going on here? That took forever. I don't have anything else to heal me except this cookie is about to drop. Yes, the crows always drop cookies. <laughs> 6 HP. You can steal my bread roll before. Who are you? Do you know where Picky is? Oh, a man's man, eh? There! Ooh, there's Picky. And there's the meteorite, and the police are gone, so I guess they didn't look around too well. Oh, you bitch dog. Come here, Picky. You look like that kid from Kids Next Door, number four. I guess he would look like you because you came out significantly before him then. Yay, Picky joins us. Picky is not as good as the dog, but he does more than Pokey does in the fact that he actually will attack. Uh, he only usually does like one HP damage though. No. You're crazy. But now I do. It's the giant space laser. No, oh, it's Buzz Buzz. Ten years in the future, and in the future, all is devastation. Mewtwo, the Universal Cosmic Destroyer. If you don't get that joke, look up the final boss of Mother 1. Wisdom, courage, and friendship. Let's get that Triforce. Three boys and a girl.
No, but if I say that, you're just going to tell me again. Buzz Buzz joined. He likes to cast Paula's spells. Three boys, he said. Uh, I'm not one of those three, am I? Uh, no. It's probably out of my chest. Pokey, Porky, whatever your name is. Go build a statue of yourself. No dogs, no crows. We got number four right there. Oh damn, it's a star man. It's been a long time, Buzz Buzz. Just a useless insect. I'll stomp you hard. And we get into the first boss battle with a Starman Jr. But we've got Buzz Buzz with us, so we're all okay. Start out by bashing him, because we don't really have much else. And puts up a psychic shield. Uh, this one, the pink one, it protects you from other psychic attacks. So basically it's like a one-hit uh, absorb for anything psychic. There's... I think three different types of shields. The one that Ness gets just reduces physical damage, which is the Shield of Light. See, like this right here won't hit us at all because we got the Psychic Shield. Uh, the pink one, which is the Psychic Shield that Paula usually gets, negates any type of psychic powers or any type of special damage. And Buzz Buzz does 117 damage. Picky does one. Pokey thought to himself, and Ness does four damage. Freeze Alpha! This is going to do nothing because we got the Psychic Shield up. And now he's got to put it back one. Picky missed. Pokey complained as usual. This does two damage. Starman's defending. Buzz Buzz charged forward for 107 damage. And Starman Jr.'s dead. What did we get? Any Christmas presents? Nope, but Ness go up to level 3. Guts. Uh, offense is obvious. It's how much damage you do. Guts is how often you get a smash attack or a critical attack. Uh, vitality, how much HP you get. IQ, uh, how much damage you do with psychics. HP, obvious. PP, psychic power. That's it. Enemies sent. As well as humans who have evil thoughts, we are going to definitely look into them because those are hilarious. Animals, that explains why the dog and the birds are attacking us. No, we are not going out and just bashing dog heads in for experience. They're actually uh, pissed off animals. So let's go take Picky Home Pokey Home. Good lord, Pokey's mom. You've got too much lipstick on. Got $20. And Pokey's father, Mr. Minch. This is a famous scene from Mother 2 in the Japanese version. It's a... Edit it out for our version because it has to do with child abuse, but whatever. Tired of your family living next door and dealing with my dumbass kid. We loaned your father a lot of money. It may have been a hundred thousand dollars or more, but I guess it really could have been less. <laughs> my family and I live in poverty. 
your blue floor and your red carpet. No, oh, Buzz Buzz, don't get into her hair. It's a dung beetle. Die. Oh, Mrs. Minch is more powerful than a star man. Hey, you. Yes. Yeah, the sound stone where you record all of the sounds and create what people say is eight melodies, but it's not. No. People keeping me up all night long, the meteor and picky and bees. Yes, yeah, got soundstone. Uh the bee's dead, okay. And here is our overworld. Oh, this guy. Oh, I forgot about this. This is the camera ban. He's going to take our picture quite a few times throughout this journey. Fuzzy pickles. Okay, that's done. Hi, Mom. Eat some steak and scoot up to bed. So you can do this at any point in the game, kind of like for a free restore. You just go back home and she feeds you. You get the same result by staying at different inns, but uh, if they don't have one of the teleport spells that you get, like, endgame... You can't really come back here all the time. Uh, you call Dad to save your game, and he also tells you however much money is going to be in the bank when you go to get it. Because in this game, when you beat the enemies, you don't get the money right away. You actually have to stop by the bank to withdraw the money first. He also tells you about how far away from you are from leveling for any of your characters. Got kind of like a remix ish of Pollyanna playing in the house. And we'll go ahead and end this here for tonight, and we'll pick up here later on. Alright, Dad, we'll do that.